Yeah. So, yeah. so yeah. what's the best way? Just, yeah. just, just uh, hold it all that Hold it like that. Okay. Come out of the okay. 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 Parishioners at St. Anne's and Walston are used to seeing the Reverend Michael Dre up behind the altar, not the bar. But the Reverend has been spending more time at the pubs these days, and no one at St. Anne's is frowning upon it. Drea is at the bar to serve Theology on Tap, an international program that aims to reach out to young Catholics with theology sessions at their local pubs. The Reverend has coined the fall session of Quincy's Theology on Tap, the six-pack of speakers, with the most notable guest being Cardinal Sean O'Malley this Wednesday at 7 p.m. The uh, Theology on Tap program reaches out to the young adult Catholics in the church in their 20s and 30s, folks who have just gotten, perhaps have just gotten out of college, getting their careers going, getting their lives uh, on, the, on the track of whatever vocation they may find themselves, whether it's moving towards marriage or whatever it may be for them. And this group is, has a tendency to be kind of the forgotten children of the church for one reason or another. Uh, we started here in Quincy in June. When I first arrived in Wollaston in 2004, just, just newly ordained, uh, I recognized in the Quincy area the vast number of young adults that we have in this, in this city and what a great opportunity it would be to start something like a theology on tap. And what's, uh, what's the response been like when Res you're doing this? The response has been excellent. Yeah. Uh, the first couple of sessions we had well over 50, close to 70 people, and uh, the response has been tremendous because it's so interesting to see young Catholics who want to engage their faith, who want to learn more. It, is it reading scripture or it's more discussion about how? Yeah. No, it's mostly discussion. The speaker will come in and present on a particular topic. As I said, something we try to choose something that's really relevant to that age group. You know, all aspects of faith are relevant to all of us, but there are particular aspects that are of more interest to folks in their 20s and 30s. Have you gotten to know the young people of Quincy and of sort of your congregation in a different way, do you think? Oh, sure, definitely. <laughs> I think, um, in fact, some of the folks that I've, I've seen here at Theology on Tap, I'm seeing down at St. Anne's at Sunday Mass. One of the things about Theology on Tap that it doesn't do is we don't come in and say to someone, when was the last time you were at church? When was the last time you went to confession? That's not what we want to ask. What we want to do is invite people to come back and re-engage their faith if they perhaps have fallen away, or if they are an active Catholic, to learn more, to go deeper in their faith. In, as I said, in a very relaxed, in a very welcoming atmosphere. Theology on Tap doesn't stand in the place of, of Sunday Mass. That is the <laughs> most important thing that we do as Catholics. The most important thing. Hearing the Word of God and receiving the Eucharist. The most important. But hopefully for those who may be sitting on the fence, it may be just that thing that will want them to come to church and to discover some more about the Lord. So you can't just come to the bar and take care of all that. <laughs> yeah, right. You can't have Mass at Let's the bar. Let's make that clear. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. How did you feel about it? I feel I'm very much open to it. Yeah. yeah. I was excited about it. Has it been interesting? It's very interesting, yeah, absolutely. Regular customers reacted. <laughs> very positive. I mean, we, we, we don't change anything. We don't we don't dress the place up because mm -hmm. theology and tap is on bad habits. Is bad habits is the way it is seven days a week. Just some extra discussion. That's all, yeah. You know, we're, we're an entertainment lounge, and it's, it's we're open for all forms of entertainment. Now we run pop quizzes, we run music, we run, we run drama. And, now we're doing theology in town. Now you have God too. God too, you've got no sign. For more coverage on Theology on Tap, see Monday's paper. This is Caitlin Keene with the Patriot Ledger.